What's up, guys? I'm pretty tipsy. Let me just let me just be up front. Okay? But in today's video, I wrote down some notes, right, about lesbian problems because today at work I was having a conversation with one of my coworkers, and it wasn't about being lesbian at all, but it was just the fact that she was so open with me about her and her boyfriend about everything, right? But and I was just in there like, I'm gay as shit. I can't relate, but me being the person that I am, not just having the lesbian title, I can understand, no matter if you're gay, straight, black, white, Mexican, whatever. So I was, I wanted to make this video because lesbians go through a lot of problems, not just mental or physical, but just stereotypical. So like I said, I wrote down a few things and, um, oh, okay, number one. We don't like all girls. Fuck no. Bitches be bonkers. Y'all know where that's from if y'all watch Netflix. But no, I love my girlfriend. She's the love of my life. I love her so much. But no, we do not like all girls. I just have to take a little breather real quick because that's the stereotypical thing. People think just because you're lesbian or gay, you know, gay is when you like men, lesbian is when you like girls, but that doesn't even matter. I'm still gay, whatever the fuck it is. I'm still, you know what I'm saying? But everybody thinks that if you're gay or whatever, you like you like the whole sex. You like everybody. And a motherfucker walking past, you like him. A girl walking past, you like her. No, it's not like that. It's really like it's not like that at all. We have we have feelings. We're not no damn robots. We're not mental, we're not mentally disabled or anything, but like, no, we do not like, we do not like all girls. No, we do not like all girls. If we are in a relationship. We like one girl. I like one girl. I love one girl. I'm in, I am in love with one girl. Go ahead and follow us on our Instagram. But that's one thing. That's that's one stupid thing. And especially the ones who are, um, what do you call it, like or anti-homosexual, I don't know, that whole word, scared of homosexuals, they think if a gay person walks past them, that, that, that automatically they're attracted to them. That's not the case, that's not the situation. Even if we're a nice person, that's not it at all. That's really disgusting for you to think that way. And um, yeah, that's like, that's like saying, if I do, if I did like dudes, right? And any dude that I knew, I would like them. Just because they're a dude. Like, no, there's all types of dicks in the world. You know what I'm saying? Not saying that I like that shit because I don't, but <laughs> don't stereotype. Second bullet point, we aren't the same. Fuck no. We are not the same. Just because you're lesbian, just because you think somebody's lesbian and you think someone else is lesbian and you, you might think they act alike or they are alike. Eight times out of 10, they're not. You know what I'm saying? There's like, honestly, like a good five type of lesbians. Lesbians don't act like lesbians, you know? Me, for example, I don't celebrate the pride, the LGBTQ community. And that's just me. I don't feel like I need to celebrate my sexuality because you know, like, damn. Like, I am the way I am, you know? I'm always gonna say I'm gay as shit, you know what I'm saying? I had never had a boyfriend. Never even had sex with a dude. Let me just be honest about that. But, I don't feel like I need to celebrate my sexuality. I've never been a pride. I've never worn a rainbow to exploit my sexuality. Only because I feel like I don't need to celebrate it. You understand? And most people aren't like that. I don't know, you know, I really don't really talk about it. I just do me, period. I just do me, you know? There's literally hillbilly lesbians and lesbians from the West Coast. Do you think we act the same? Do you think we think the same? There's redneck lesbians and there's country lesbians. I'm talking about maybe black and white, Mexican, Asian, Samoan. Hell no, we don't all think the same. Oh my gosh. I hate hearing that or even like having the conversation or just seeing videos. Like seriously, why are you so stereotypical? Okay, the last bullet point I wanted to come across was studs versus dykes. 
Now, this bullet point is just straight up for me and the people who are like me. I have, I'm a no label type of person. You know, I dress the way I dress. I am who I am, I like who I like, you know? I don't wanna be like, oh, I'm a no label. I just live my life, you know what I'm saying? I'm not a dyke. <laughs> I'm never I'm never usually called a dyke. But when people argue with me, that's that's what they wanna call me to hurt me. And I'm just like, I know a few dykes. <laughs> and I'm not a dyke. <laughs> it is just funny as fuck. I would consider myself a stud because, you know, I have I I have I have necessary or not necessary. I have fuck, what's that word? I forgot the word, but you can tell I'm a female, you know, not if I wear like, you know, a baggy ass sweater and I'm just, you know, baggy ass jeans because I do wear that sometimes. But straight females do the same thing. And I'm a female, period. So don't say I'm a dyke. Like, what does a dyke even mean? What is a dyke? I mean, I know what a dyke is. Like, I can picture a dyke. A bitch with a shaved head. She sags to her knees. Wears heavy ass t-shirts. Has, probably has tattoos. Maybe like tattoo on her eyebrow. And she wears boxer. And she probably wears like, I don't know, Nike. I don't know. But that's a dyke. I don't look nothing like that. But like I'm saying, besides that, what's a fucking dyke? Okay, what's a stud to a dyke? Because besides the studs and looking more female than dykes, in, in reality, what's the fucking difference? You know what I'm saying? Um, I really don't like being called a dyke because I don't sit there and really try to be a dude. You know, studs, we got nigga tendencies. But we ain't no nigga. You know what I'm saying? Like, we got, we got nigga tendencies. We do certain things. But we're as close to femmes as, as there is. I would never wear a dress. Most studs wouldn't. But we'll wear, like, a casual female, maybe tight-suited suit. But then again, maybe not that fucking tight. You know what I'm saying? But those are my, those are my three bullet points on lesbian problems. And that's just my point of view. Um, that's pretty much it. If you're new, subscribe. Comment down below if you want some more. Follow me on SoundCloud. I'm about to release some more music. I'm about to chill here. You know what I'm saying. And um, yeah, add me on Instagram. Add me on Snapchat. And I'll see y'all later.